this was the guy in the morning giving the guidelines of the hike we are going to have uh, it was very very beautiful scenery that I have ever seen in my life because I have a hike in all of most of the volcanoes but look at this beautiful water there are a lot of water in the volcano I was going to say water <laughs> But I must tell you, there are a lot of water in the volcanoes. And this is me hiking so quick. And then this guide, he was just, it's not a guide, it's a porter. He was just carrying the gas at the door. Yeah, look at where we are going. Oh my God. It was like really far. That was like at 2 p.m. Yeah. Uh, and then here we arrived at the campsite. You can see all of four volcanoes lining at the same line. I was so excited. I was trying to act like a YouTuber, you see, and I was explaining everything and <laughs> I was really excited. And at some point, I was like, what am I even doing? I don't even understand. <laughs> so this was the best experience and then because it worth it then I repeated it and I was just showing you guys how beautiful this can be so what do you do if you don't really hike what do you do in your life because it's not just about hiking it's about the beautiful view like look at this look at this feeling like you have a level at the top of this the highest peak in Rwanda imagine being there so yeah this house i didn't catch it where it was the campsite and then we have to light up fire and some people they were drying up their shoes because you must always take the boot you know the plastic boot it is the safest guys so this is was uh, this was in the morning uh, going at the top and the water was frozen like it was really frozen I thought I was going to to die because it was almost five degree I have never experienced that you know but the sunlight was really really beautiful you know look at the people they are like the sunlight and here you can get a beautiful view of Mikeno and look at me at the top.